Okay, class, with our new lesson, we are going to begin to talk about website design and layout. So every single modern website has the same basic principles to it. We traditionally have this horizontal nav bar at the very top and a couple pieces of information tied along with that. We call this entire section the header. And then inside of our header, we are traditionally going to have a navigation bar. Then we traditionally usually have this very large image. We're going to call this the hero image. But for right now, don't pay attention too much to it. Just know that this is what we call a hero image. And then each additional part is broken off into sections. Notice how that this is kind of divided. And we have some division. And then at the very bottom, we have this thing that is kind of persistent on all pages, even if I went to the watch. The header realistically is kind of the same. And then if I scroll down to the bottom, that footer is what we call it is the same. So we have a header, the content, and a footer. Now, if this is true across all websites, Weaver states, we have our header here, and then we have our nav bar right here, and then a hero image, the content, and then a footer. We go to WSD.net, same basic thing. We have a header with a nav bar. We scroll down, we have a hero image. And at the very bottom, we have a footer. So let's code a website that follows this design principle. So what we're gonna do is we're starting out fresh, blank slate here. And inside my body, I am going to add what's called a header tag. So we say header. And then we're going to close that out. And then we have what we call the main section. And that's where all of our content went. So we say main. And we do a slash main there. And then finally, at the very bottom, we have a footer. No, I did not put the closing tag there. So we have a footer. Now, this is um, inside of main is where most of the content for the website is going to go. It's that you have all done before. But for right now, we're going to talk about a header. And the header is where we also put our navigation bar and then later our hero image. Like I said, we're not going to worry about the hero image for now. But inside of our header is where we put our nav section. We've all done this before. And then we do a slash nav. And then we have a UL for an unordered list. Slash UL. And then we have all of our LIs. You know, just your basic nav section. LI. And we've all done this before. So we say LI. And then we're going to have an anchor tag that goes to an href equal sign, goes to some link, and let me close that out, and then this is our link text, text, and then we do our slash a, and our slash li. So this is your basic website layout. We have our header that's inside our body, our main, and our footer. And then we have our nav section that's inside of the header, and our nav section is comprised of a list of links. All right. We'll follow up for our next episode. We're going to build a school website.